Hey guys, it's your boy Dino aka DLP here and welcome back to another video from my channel and another video of me reacting to Holy Life guys, yes. Um, as you can see by the title, I'll be reacting to the song Loser Girl, the cover song. Now, I did get asked a lot of this question during this time. It is um, apparently because um, the cover song of Loser Girl that was on the pool was done by Matsuri, but apparently there's another version, there's two versions in Holy Life. One's done by Matsuri. Or one that's done by poker so there's both versions and it was going to be one of those things where people ask me are you going to do both versions uh and i recently did that for blessing uh, the blessing cover i did actually all three covers right so it was a pretty long video and i did say i did say that this is not something i'm going to be doing a lot of you know i mentioned this in the last video uh, in that video of blessing. It's not something I'm going to do all the time uh, And I can do it when I feel like you know, I can actually get it done Like if I have the time then I can actually go ahead and do that and this is one of those times. Yes This is one of those times. Don't worry uh, A lot of you guys were gonna say no Dina's not gonna do it. No, I am um, So I'm gonna be reacting to both cover songs um, of loser girl done by one Matsuri and two by Poker uh so yeah the, once again i am gonna say this this is not gonna be something i gonna do all the time <laughs> i would do it if i have the time if i don't have time unfortunately to do multiple covers done by someone in the song i won't be able to do it then i'll just react to it on a separate video on its own uh so i hope you guys understand <laughs> but since i am um, going break soon i have been doing some pre-recordings i've done a few already actually uh, so and I did say I'm gonna give my I'm gonna give it one last push to deliver the amazing content for you guys because I love you guys so much. <laughs> so uh, without further ado, let's get right to it. Like, you know, mm, mm. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, set both of these covers up for you, and once that's done, and uh, you know once I've set those up, I will go ahead and react to it for you. So I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys. So um, finally got everything set up to go. Um, what I noticed, which was actually surprising, for some reason, for some odd reason, since I saw Matsuri's, you know, Matsuri's Loser Girl cover song on Nepal, I assumed her one was going to be the one that was done first. No, uh, Poco's one was the one that was done first. She did hers on January the 30th, 2021, this year, at, basically at the start of the year. Matsuri's one is the one that came after Poker's, which is July 25th. So that's the Matsuri's one is actually the most recent one, um, which is actually pretty interesting. Um, how, how? Okay, so let me let me just um, open this PC screen. There you go. So Matsuri's at 1.5, 1.15 million subscribers, and Poker's at 856 k subscribers. She's almost a uh, you know over 800 k. This one's uh, 341k and going, I would assume. So yeah, um, I'm excited to see what how these songs are, I'll be honest. Uh, duh, I'm going to be listening to Matsuri's cover first because that was technically the one on the pool, right? So it only makes sense that I'll react to that first and then I'll go ahead and check out Poker's version. Uh, so yeah, let's get right to it. This might be a slightly long video uh, because I'm doing multiple cover songs. Like I said, it's not something I'll be doing every time, but if I do have the time, I'll do it for sure. Um, let's see, uh, PC screen's fine, uh, volume's doing good, um, let's get right to it, you know, Matsuri probably, she was probably one of the first, okay, you know, one of the few girls that I actually took a liking to in Holy Life, in fact, might be the first one ever, uh, that I took a liking to, so yeah, I'm excited to see how she, uh, sings, because I've seen, I've seen a few of her songs, um, you know, she did, do, do, she did a song with, uh, Goa, and she also did a song with Rika, uh, the Holostar member, Rika, I think so. Um, I might be wrong with the Holostar name though, but yeah, uh, she's got a good voice. She's got a good voice, so I'm excited to see what this is like. It's been a while since I've listened to Matsuri, right? So let's go. In three, two, one, half. Everything seems okay. <laughs> um, By the way, there's no subs, so yeah. I couldn't find subs for it, so it's okay.
it's been a while since I'm, you know, since I've heard her voice, so it's great to hear her voice again. <laughs> oh, is that mini, mini Matsui right there? Oh, that's cute. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Okay. <laughs> the artwork though. The artwork's good. Surprising. Not. <laughs> it's totally live art though, so. I feel like if I knew Japanese a lot more than I know now, this lyrics will be a lot more impactful for some reason. It will be. I really like the artwork, it's done so well. Huh. Interesting. Um She's good, she's done this really well. She's sung this really well. It feels like it's talking about a girl who's, you know, behind everyone else, I guess, in a way. It's hard to tell. Dang. It's good. It's good. There's a bit of speed right there in that song, that, that verse right there. <laughs> this is cute. That's cute. Wow, okay. Damn, okay, that, that, that finished much quicker than I thought. Okay, um... Judging from this title of the song, Loser Girl, and how the storyboard, I guess... Obviously, there's a storyboard behind the, the song, right? You could tell. It felt like it was kind of like... This song was kind of like... I don't know what the lyrics mean. By any chance, if I see in like a subbed version or like a lyric version within the comments or something, I would actually be able to tell what this is kind of like. Because like, if you think about it, this, judging from Matsuri itself, like Matsuri, you get to see Matsuri's face, right? During the song. And she's showing off a lot of emotions, her being emotional, her crying, her being nervous, her being stressed out, her being frustrated. You know, it shows a lot of emotions from Matsuri. And depend, you know, considering the song is called Lose a Girl, right? I don't know whether this song is kind of about her feeling like she needs to work a lot harder than the other members. Because they showed silhouette of other members, I'm assuming. And I don't know if it's kind of like Matsuri has to work harder than the other... Or she feels like she has to work harder than the other members for her to stay on... Not stay on top, but stay in the same league in a way and not lag behind. I don't know, I might be just babbling on like a bunch of crap, but it's kind of like the feeling I'm getting off because he, he, there was a lot of emotions in her and I'm sure it might reflect to how Matsuri was feeling at the time or maybe something that she felt in the past, right, when she was in Hololive. So, but and on top of that, all the Hololive me members had some sort of hardships and difficulties when they were in Hololive or before they joined Hololive, you know, so that this could be kind of like a song reflecting on that in a way so yeah uh yeah you see lots of emotions in the cover you definitely are a loser girl to me Matsuri so yeah you see that the, you see the the fact that people say this makes me think that Matsuri in a way feels this you know that she's a loser girl and she has to you know put a lot more effort than compared to the other members to you know being on the same league as them don't know why but I love listening to Matsuri covering to you song to you song Ah, oh, okay, it's, it's kind of like the original song. Okay, let, 
with the original, so I'm not gonna listen to it, duh. Uh, what's... <laughs> it's gonna be pretty high on the views. Okay, yeah, I'm not gonna listen to that. Um, 4.8 million views, man, Jesus. And it was done last year. It's not even last year, fam. Like, <laughs> um, it's getting close to one year now. Um, Motley be throwing covers on original type of mom throwing sandals. <laughs> Thomas, man, that's not, that was funny. You know what? That gets a like, but that's funny. <laughs> Motsuri's voice in the songs hits as hard as Sandals. Jesus Christ, is it that hard? Um, what's the emotions from the song and it really moves the impurity Motsuri has. Motsuri has said she feels at time. Oh, okay, she's, she's mentioned it. I'm sure Motsuri is doing well, especially with such an awesome th third birthday live recently, but I feel. I still think it's healthy to just scream out your emotions through a song like this. Okay, right. Okay, yeah, another banger cover, man. This song slaps hard, the struggle, the effort, the sadness to do something and still think you're not doing enough. Yeah, so I want to be like, hey, yeah, I can't become like her. So it's kind of like, it's kind of like what I said, right? Because, like, she, she to her, it feels like she needs to do more work than the average person or compared to the other her lab members in order to be as good as them. I don't know. I'm. I might be wrong, but then again, people are saying something, you know, under similar lines, right? So, yeah, yeah. It feels like it feels like she's really struggled for a lot, and obviously, I've seen emotional moments with Matsuri and her experiences and whatnot. So, yeah, it, it, this song does definitely reflect in a way. Um, Yo, Matsuri killed it. I, it, like I said, it's been a while since I've listened to Matsuri, and I, I, I totally missed the voice. I totally missed the voice. I mean, like I said, she's one of the first girls that I actually took a liking to in Holly Life. You know, until then, I saw the girls and I was like, yeah, this looks good. And then I see Matsuri for the first time, and I'm like, okay, she's got a cute avatar. Her, her you know, her, you know, her design of her avatar looks really good and really cute. And then, you know, the more I watched her, the more I really took a liking to her. And that's when, you know, it started. So it started to really dive into the whole live uh, rabbit hole. Until then, it was kind of like, eh, like that. So Matsuri was kind of like the lead way for me. So she's always going to have that special place in me. <laughs> so, of course, uh, you know, uh, you know, I, you know, no matter what she's gone through, she's doing well. Uh, and I'm sure, you know, she's, you know, she's always going to be doing well. Obviously me and I'm sure a lot of other fans would want the best for her. Uh, I mean, look at this. On average, on average, it's almost 100k per views, you know, per stream, in a way. Look at this. Apex, right there, 150k views, man. Apex again. Like, like it's always like from 60 to 100k views, like on average, which is amazing. <laughs> so... Yeah, she's she's doing well. She's doing well for herself. And I'm sure she's enjoying her time in Hololive as well. There's no way she's not enjoying her time. Definitely a tough journey, I'm sure. Because it's, it's not easy to become well-known in Hololive and actually do it as kind of like a hobby slash job, right? But that's the thing. It's so... It, it, when you do a job that was... When you do a job in life that you actually enjoy doing... And it's kind of like a hobby for you in the same time. That's when you know you're satisfied. That's when you know you're truly satisfied. When you're doing something you enjoy, like as a job, when you're doing, when you're working or doing a job that you actually enjoy doing. So like in this case, I'm sure some of the whole life members are actually doing this as their main source of income, right? Whole life. And they're enjoying their time. That's when you know they're truly satisfied. That and no, it's not just Hollow Knight members. It's just people in general. It, you know, obviously, there's gonna be times in life where you gotta work certain jobs and you're not gonna enjoy it, but you would have to do it. It's a necess it's it's necessary to do it to get to other places that you do want to actually go to. Then yeah, that's just the tough road you have to take. If you want to get something, if you want to, if you want to get something in life, you gotta work for it, guys. So <laughs> you know, you can't just sit down and just expect it to come to you. You have to chase after it. You know, it's one of those things. So I'm in this case, you know, Matsuri's, you know, done well. So sorry, I went a bit off tangent there. <laughs> so, um, poker. Okay, let's check out poker. I mean, like I said, over eight hundred k views. Her her one did come early after all, so it's gonna have more views. Te you know, logically speaking so yeah let's get right to it i'm excited to see poker's 
you know, listening to Poco's voice. I'm excited for it. So let's get to this. I'm sure it's going to have, you know, the sort of the same emotions that I felt from Matsuri and whether the storyboard is going to be similar as well in a way, I don't know. Because let's be honest, they're both different people. They both must have had different struggles. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it goes in three, two, one, go. Oh, her voice up. Her voice is distinctly different from Matsuri as well. Her voice is very different to Matsuri. But it's still good. Oh, Dane, look at that. Dane. That's emotion right there showing. Her voice is good as well, Poker's Poker's po voice is actually very good as well. <laughs> the artwork. It seems like this artwork. It seems like this artwork looks a bit more detailed than the Matsuri one. I can't tell. I might be wrong. Yeah, it's the same face as well. The same sort of face. <laughs> wow, both of them have killed this song, man. Both of them have already done a great job with the song. I mean, on top of that, it, you know, when I've told you this in the last video that I always listen to the original songs, if this song looks as good as it is, Oh, dude, the song is always going to be good. The detail in this art, though, looks good. Rugaruma. <laughs> this song's definitely like talking about. Like this song does definitely give off like an instance of the singer's emotions in a way to talk about the struggles that they had to go through. And you can tell from the artwork. Damn. You see, she, they don't have much space to breathe in between, it's crazy. Damn. That is crazy. I just literally only noticed that, but certain parts in the song during the verses they don't even have much time to breathe as well like you you just have to take a deep breath and then start singing again right it's not like and then they just start singing it's like a very frat it's like like a second literally a second for you to take the take a breath in and then start singing again so you can actually sing the whole verse without losing your breath it's crazy because the, you know those kind of stuff you know those kind of those kind of the ability to do that it's not easy it's not something you can just do that like in overnight or something you know you gotta take a lot of lessons in singing or practice a lot on singing to actually have the ability to take in you know a nice deep breath and without exhaling just start singing right so you could sing for longer and i'm sure you know it's like that with Matsuri's song as well with um polka as well so it's kind it's kind of it's kind of difficult it's not easy to do it ain't easy to do wait is the camera just weird in a way it was weird fuck's sake <laughs> so yeah once again you get to see a lot of emotions through polka as well definitely like at this point polka's just not the whole circus she's in 
She's the entire entertainment industry. What the heck? Um, Lose girl. The lyrics are both heartwarming and heartbreaking. Oh, this is the lyrics. I did my best, but it's not enough. Can someone teach me what to do? Oh, this is going to be an emotional one, but I love this song. The name of the theme of Never Give Up for the Dream really fit polka personality. I'm going to loop this for 2021. Interesting. I did my best, but it's not enough. Can someone teach me what to do? Dang. This is a song which most fit with personal experiences exactly yeah that's well said alfred um alfred has made a great point this is something which mostly fits with someone with personal experiences where they had to struggle for a lot and had to do stuff that that's required to do a lot more than other people and they have to do a lot more than certain people in order to actually get to that level but even then they would feel like it's not enough like no matter what you do you you always get that feeling when you try to do something and you put a lot of hard work to it you always think it's not enough it's always been like that me as well i'm currently training currently trying to get in the best shape of my life and it's going well don't get me wrong it's going well but every time i see myself it's kind of like it's not enough i have to do more i have to do more and I feel like I feel like the fact that I love working out helps me a lot with motivating myself as well. You know, I just love working out in general. So that that the fact that I have love and passion for working out is a great motivation for me. So yeah, it's it's just one of those things where you, yeah, it's it, yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy to think how the the song can really show what they feel about you know the things that they do in life right thank you for giving us safe haven uh both dealing with i don't know those names i don't know um it's been a while since i've le you know learned japanese so i do apologize uh i'm sure they're trying to say maybe matsuri and now poker both dealing with real psychological problems who are rightly perceived by the singer. I predict we will see a conclusion to all of this. I don't know if you just do this for us, but also for your own sake. If it's just for us, thank you very much. It helps. If it's, if it's also for your own sake, I hope you can help and fight the good fight. I fought 15 years against my depression. Wow. 15 years, man. Holy shit. Like, three years now, depression free. You know what? Hey man, good for you, <laughs> good for you, guy or girl, good for you, <laughs> absolutely, that's, that's crazy, three years now depression free after a fight, after battling it for 15 years, must be a great feeling, like straight up, <laughs> depression ain't like, like this thing that people just use as an excuse, you know, but here's the thing, there's a difference between, you, you would know when someone's actually depressed and someone's trying to fake it, right, but the people who are genuinely depressed, and going through depression and going through therapy it's it's not an easy battle i've seen it i've seen it with my own eyes uh, but nearly every day i fear it can come back and i have to fight it both of your covers are really helping also poker helps a lot the chaotic nature the emotional instabil instability and having the power to keep going um is it true that poker is depression i saw you know what you never that's the thing you never know there's always something there's always like the other side of things you get to see the natural good side and the fun side of them and you just we just don't know the other side until they reveal it themselves right it's hard to tell um but yeah terror terror search you say you feared that you might come back and have to fight it again you went through 15 years of depression and you fought it and won and three years that depression free i'm sure if it comes back you you do a great job of fighting it back so don't worry about that you know what i like that Wow, she gave a different feel to certain parts and gave it more emotion. I listened to both of them, they're both different in comparison. While the original was soft and sad, you would cry, but this cover was realistic, painful tone. I mean, I have to listen to the original one to actually see what this is. Um, you unlocked secret ending. <laughs> you know, now that it says this, I don't think it's Matsuri. Matsuri's one, because Matsuri's one came much later. She, Matsuri's version is much recent. So maybe this is poker and then the original singer i think i think that's what they're trying to say though maybe it's the original singer and then poker because um Matsui was one was very very recent um but yeah both of them had um such emotions with us uh, with the you know both of them you know did their job of singing it really well 
Uh, at times it felt like they had very little space to breathe, like when singing, which is crazy. It's, it ain't easy to do and obviously through the pictures and their voices it shows that they're carrying a lot of emotions within them or they're referring to a lot of emotions they've had in the past. So, I, I, But then again, both of them are in a good place right now. They're both in a place where uh, members around them are hella supportive and the team management, I'm sure. Um, okay, so four days ago, 88k, five days ago, 129k, seven hours ago, 72k, six days ago, 82k. See, once again, she's killing it as well. Look at this, you know, you know 83k, 105k, 155k, 121k, 94k, 90k, 70, 274k. You see, see, they're, they're killing it. You know, these girls, they, these girls do something that they enjoy. I feel like whole life is a great, it's one of those things where it really helps them with whatever they're going through, I'm sure. I'm sure it helps them a lot with whatever they're going through. So, yeah, uh, that was my reaction to both of the covers of Loser Girl being Matsuri and Polka, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Um, now that I get to listen to these stuff, I, you, get, you know that they, they struggle. These guys are just as human as us, right? You know, the, you, <laughs> they are just as human as us, guys. So... You know, as the viewers, us, you know, us viewers are human. These guys are just as human as well. And they go, they have their own shares of, you know, difficulties, stress and hardships. So, yeah, let's let's do our best and give them the support we, we can give them, you know. You know, the support they need to carry on. I'm sure they're having a great time in Hollywood as well. So, yeah, if you guys did enjoy today's video, be sure to smash the like button. Comment and share the loads of good things so you see more content on me doing more uh, holiday videos like this in the future. However, uh, if you guys are new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button. Join the DRP Guild today so you won't miss a single video from my channel where there's reactions to holiday, reactions to Ruby, reactions to Jujutsu Kaisen, any other reaction videos, main content series you get to see on this channel. So be sure to come in, subscribe, and join the journey. So, as always, guys, this is your boy Dina signing out. Have a nice day, stay awesome, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So, until then, peace.